harder people in the place to be. What's going on? It's me. It's me. Oh, for those of you who are wondering what I was drinking in the Brooke Hogan video in this glass here, that was rum and soda. Rum and soda, party people. If you're keeping tabs, and then of course homemade homeboy margarita. You know me. I don't like to shoot just one thing at a time. In keeping with the theme, the whitest moments in history by Joe Santiago starts right now. Everyone, welcome to the whitest moments in history. Since I myself am a white person, I can tell you exactly when we're doing some really white shit. The most recent Santa Gato. That's not a white last name, homie. Broke out. The news Jose. The craziest woman they could find, and this is what she had to say. Do you know how this fire started? Yes, I do. It was because of my cousin. He's mad because he couldn't. He can't get with me. I'm married to my husband. This woman gets on live TV and she goes, yeah, no, my cousin, she, he started this fire because he wants to get with me, but he can't because I'm married to fucking Kid Rock over here. And it's a long story. He looks more sure like, uh, a, long story. a story that I want to He looks know. more like, uh, who's a skinny the dude? Secondary at this point, I want to know about this love triangle. Put it in an editing. You, your cousin, and fucking Joe Dirt. So he already put him in a hospital. Not Joe Dirt. This cousin is out of control. He wants to get with her so bad that he beat up her husband and set her house on fire. Who said chivalry was dead? And what the fuck is this shit? Jesus, Alyssa, I know you're trying to have a cool, like, family picture for the Christmas card, but Jesus Christ. The fact that these people are naked is completely unnecessary, unsanitary, and downright unacceptable. And a bunch of un-words. Bunch of words that have un before it. This is fucking all of them. Whose idea is this? Who's running the show? Is it you, Dad? Hey, what if we, uh, we all, we're all naked, and we just stack... We'll stack each other in size order on top of each other. No! This one kid has his meat missile pressed up against his mom's ass. What about that is okay? What did they think was... Did they think people were going to walk into their house and be like, Oh my god, this is such a lovely photo. This isn't like incest at all. I like it. No, it's cool. What the fuck? Get it together! Some of us are his incest. I don't know. J j just shut the fuck up and report the news. Who the hell are you trying to appeal to, lady? This isn't MTV. Just tell me if I gotta wear a jacket or not, and that's it. Stop trying to make cold fronts sound cool. And here we have Rupert. Rupert kept a 12-foot alligator tied and blindfolded for the last month, sexually assaulting the reptile multiple times a day. Stop! What the hell? First of all, I didn't even know you could. Sexual Multiple assault. times a day, ladies. You hear that? I mean, if I thought, are you listening? Assume that they did. I just. I, I think he's available. I, I must have missed that episode on Discovery Channel. The gator tried to eat me, and this was revenge, pure and simple. I don't have no sexual attraction to gators, but I want to teach this bitch a lesson. I could have just killed her, but that would have been too easy. She was getting what she deserved. This man is upset that an alligator tried to eat him. Sir, it's an alligator. It's supposed to eat you. Not only that. But your reaction to this is, I'm gonna kidnap this alligator and just sexually assault it all the time. What kind of response is that? By the way, I'm not a fucking scientist or anything, but I'm pretty sure you're not supposed to put your dick in an alligator vagina. Mainly because it's a fucking alligator. That's how you like create new STDs. Like two months down the line, this guy's dick's gonna turn inside. And how do you know that there's like, not something like what dogs have that'll you trap your it. shit? I don't know what you did. What, it, what happened? Last but not least, we have this. Listen, we really need to stop putting our kids on leashes because it's a kid and not a dog. The only reason your child should have a My mother put me on a leash when I was a little kid. Fucking Mount Everest, yes, she did. Which if it, I, is, it was a rainbow colored a leash because I was so born in the mid 80s and everything was rainbow Just colored before the gays stole it. Like a uh, but my mom put me on a leash. Yes, she did. Why? Because I would run away. And apparently I was so friendly I would walk away with like any stranger who was just like, hey, hey, that was me. So she put me on a leash. But I will see you guys next week. I'm going to like this video. I'm going to subscribe to your channel. But I'm going to say this. Joe Santagato. Santagato. Come on. If that. Doesn't sound like a non-white name. I don't know what does. Santagato. Sa wait, Santagato. Sant. San Santagato. San Santagato. Sant. Sant. See that? That almost wants to sound Italian, but it really sounds Latin, Mexican, port. You know, and that's re. You know, that's Hispanic, Latin, 
Um, uh, Mexican, you're, you're all those. Sorry if I offend you. Come on, dude. Come on. James Roday at least changed his name to James, or, uh, uh, sorry, what's his name? Ha Jaime Rodriguez? That's racist. I believe changed his name to James Roday. Uh, Martin Estevez changed his name to Martin Sheen. Carlos Estevez changed his name to Charlie Sheen. If you're gonna pass, Try to pass. Oh, I'm a white guy. Sure you are, buddy. So am I. Uh, I like this one. He's gonna get a subscription to my channel because that that was fun. That was funny. It's not even necessarily anything that he said. It was the fact that he found the 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 family that was stacked up on top of each other naked, like zombies, just kind of started to build one of those big sandwiches, like one of those big Dagwood sandwiches. That. That, 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 that was weird. Most of those were some pretty white shit, except for the kids on the leash. Only white people do it now, but my mom did it to me when I was little. The picture was pretty white. The fucking an alligator, because it almost tried to eat you. That's, that's in the category of white in the subsection of redneck. And I didn't see where exactly that story was from. Rupert is from Collier County. And Collier County is in, wouldn't you know it, Florida. Fucking Florida. That's in the category of white folk shit. Subsection redneck shit. Sub subsection fucking Florida shit. Like just fucking. Let me know what you think about this party, people. Let me know what you think about anything on the channel. Let me know what you think about Joseph. Tagato and Joe said Tagato is watching because I tag all the videos uh, with the creators and all the shit that I put up. Let me know. Santagato, Italian or Ole? Let me know. Boom. Boom. And boom. Suplex City, Suplex City, bitch. Suplex City, Suplex City, bitch. Suplex City, Suplex City, bitch.